Welcome to the screencast in which we will uh, calculate the distance between two points over the great circle with the use of a dot product. So let's first make a sketch of the world equator. So here we have the meridian of New York, which will be point A. And we have another point, Cape Agulas, which is the south of South America, which we will call point B. So what we need is the center of the Earth, called M, and then we construct a factor from M to New York, which we call factor A, and another factor from midpoint to Cape Agulas, which we call factor B. Now generally we know that uh, the dot product, dot product is given as a times b, a dot b is the length of factor a times the length of factor b times the cosine of the angle between. So here we have the angle. So if we know the angle, uh, we know the distance we will, because we know that one degree equals 60 nautical miles. So for, um, so have a look at, at a, an angle, say here, alpha, and we have this factor length A and B. It doesn't matter what kind of range uh, length of factor we choose, because uh, here and here, the ranges are different, the length of the factor is different, but the angle remains the same. So we could say here, we choose for both lengths A and B, uh, length 1. In our drawing that would mean we take a radius of the Earth of 1, which is not correct of course, but, but it doesn't influence the angle. So with this 1 we can say the dot product equals the cosine of the angle between factor A and B, so we could easily calculate the angle, which is the arc cosine of the dot product. So what we need to do is to calculate the dot product of these two factors. So let's have a look at the coordinates. Uh, New York um, has coordinates 40 degrees, 20 minutes north and 73 degrees, 50 minutes west, point A. And this is from the NP 136 on page uh, 79. The NP 136 is the ocean passages of the world. Most ocean going vessels will uh, have it on board. And there you can find all the smart routes between uh, different points. So, second point is Cape Gulas which equals uh, 35 degrees 0 05 minutes south and 0 20 0 minutes east equals point B. So next thing we have to do is put these coordinates, which are sphere coordinates with uh, latitude and longitude, we put them to x, y, z. So generally we could say that uh, from a sphere to x, y, z, the uh, x coordinate equals the radius times the cosines of the latitude times the cosines of the longitude y would be r times cosines v sine lambda and z is something like r times sinus v. Okay, we have to do these calculations for um, both New York and Cape Agulas. Maybe you could pause the video here and do that yourself. Um, I did it and for New York I got the following coordinates x equals 0 0.2118 something, y is minus 0 0.7307, and the z value is 0 0.6490. It is important that you use uh, all the digits here in your calculator, because the distances are so large that every um, digit matters. What I will do, I put these numbers in my calculator by a variable letter. Um, what I do is I make a kind of schedule here, say this is the variable and this is your uh, calculator and 
in my calculator a is something like the uh, latitude of a and the longitude of a is b uh, etc so keep a track of your variables otherwise you will not know which variable is what number so for uh, cape agulas i got something like x is 0 0.76897 y is 0.27998 and z is 0.58 so just remind that the radius is 1 and just make these calculations over here for x y and z so now i would like to calculate the dot product okay the dot product normally say i have two factors 1 2 dot 3 4 would mean 1 times 3 added by 2 times 4, 8 would be something like 11. But for a computer that doesn't work. You have to, you should have transposed this factor. So that, that you have 1, 2, and there you have 3, 4. Because your calculator or computer will say, well, I have uh, two columns and two rows here. So it, it's 1 times 3 added by 2 times 4, 8, and this will give the same. So for your calculator or computer, you probably have to do something like, say this is your factor A, or matrix A, and this is your factor or matrix B. The dot product of A and B would be something like A transpose times B, and in my case, I got something like minus 0 0.414648 all those digits here matter because it's a big distance this equals the cosine of the angle between um, the two uh, uh, factors I shouldn't use here phi it's more because it might uh, disturb you it's not the, so I could say alpha or whatever because I use phi for the latitude of the coordinates so then, uh, so make this alpha, maybe that's better. So alpha is uh, arc cosine is of the 0 0.4146, etc. Gives us about 114.497 degrees. Time 60 is something like um, 6869.8 dot eight nautical miles so this is a way uh, to calculate the great circle distance between new york and cape agulas with the use of a dot product thanks for watching